Yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Tay. I know it's been a while since I dropped a video, so I'm happy to be back. Um, today, I'm actually doing a video, just a first impressions of this MX Vertical mouse that was just put out by Logitech. Hope you guys can see it, like it's in focus. Um, I work on a computer all the time, so I'm big on ergonomic mouse, especially as a UX designer. I've been using the MX Master, the original one. This mouse has been, you know, the best premium mouse that I've actually used. I had a few vertical mouses that I used back in the day. They were like Anchor or Sharp. Um, ones I've got off of Amazon, they basically were the same, just different brands slapped onto them. Um, so they stopped working fairly quickly and I had to get replacements. So definitely happy that Logitech went ahead and dropped this thing. It does come in at $100, but if you stick to the end of the video, I'm gonna let you know how you can get it a little bit cheaper. Um, it just came out in the last like week or two, and um, it has like 4,000 DPI, so it's gonna be really fast as far as scrolling. Um, you can actually adjust it and customize it to your liking. You can adjust the vertical uh, scrolling as well, and you can also connect this uh, three different ways. So one of the good things is that it does has USB Type A, um, no, USB Type C, the new standard um, that you see with a lot of Android devices. You can also connect it using the little Logitech USB that you plug into your computer, or you can just use Bluetooth and you can connect to multiple devices. Like I have this connected to up to three, but I use it with two. Um, so I'm pretty sure this one is gonna be two, two to four devices with like, Let's actually get into it. Good thing is for Mac and it's for Windows, so you good to go either way, no matter what kind of operating system you're using. And it's just simple packaging, but let's get to it. So one of the things you're gonna notice when you're unboxing, there's a mouse, you get the USB type C. Um, let's get this in focus, USB type C. It does has your USB type A on the opposite end that you'll have to actually plug into like a charger or into your computer. Next up, have this little dongle. If you wanna actually connect um, your mouse to your computer and you don't wanna use the cable and you don't wanna use Bluetooth, you just connect this in and you're good to go. Also USB type A. So stepping over to the actual mouse, I wanted to actually fill this for the first time so you guys can see I've been like lifting it up from the bottom so you can get my reaction of how good this actually feels in the hand. So I can tell you straight up, it feels dope. <laughs> it's a, it feels a little big at the bottom, like right here. This is definitely a little fat, but all the rest of it. This is really nice, um, feels premium. I can't say that my MX Master, you know, I've been using this, like I said, for a good amount of months. This does feel a lot better, um, feels a little bit more premium, and they both are $100 mice, or mice, but uh, yeah, it feels really good. We got a couple of buttons down here, and Nice little switcher at the top. You can power it on down here at the bottom. Um, and it looks like it connects to three devices. And it, it is laser, so you don't need an actual mouse pad. Um, I actually was holding the other one in my hand and was able to just, it was just able to shine the laser off my hand and move the mouse around. So it's really cool. So it definitely has that like handshake type of feel. Um, it's really nice and textured over here, so where you can rush your thumb at, like this feels really, really good. I really like the logo up here at the top. Um, overall, it feels like it's a nice mouse. I gotta actually use it. The battery life is supposed to last up to four months, and you can get like, I believe it said, off a one minute charge, you can get three hours um, worth of usage. So, I mean, that's dope. You should definitely not be running out of battery anytime soon. Um, actually, using this mouse, just gotta get like I said, gotta get used to using a vertical mouse again and 
let you guys know I actually vibe with this because it feels a little weird. This this feels like I love this feel, but vertical definitely is better for your wrist as it's more natural, it's more ergonomic, and it's the natural way that you would shake someone's hand or if you just lift your hand straight up, it comes up in a vertical you know, stance. Not like this. This becomes very awkward for your arms and your elbow and your shoulder, and this is definitely going to help out a lot better. And I just got to use a little bit in real world uses. So shout out to Logitech. But like I said, if you guys stuck to the end of the video, I was going to go ahead and show you how to get it a little bit cheaper. So I'm going to go ahead and switch to the desktop view and show you guys how you can get this for a lot less than $100. Let's get it. All right. So like I said, if you actually want to purchase this um, Logitech MX Vertical brand new from Logitech or from most retailers, it's going to be $99. So if you look right here on the Logitech website and click buy now, uh, what it'll actually do is you can add it to the cart and buy it on Logitech's website or click on online retailers and it'll show you who else has it. So right now it's just showing Dell, but uh, I believe Amazon has it as well, but it's all $100. So if you are actually a student or know someone who is a student, um, you can just head over to unidays.com sign up with your student ID and this would be good because you'll be able to get discounts on tons of things but what you actually want to do is go over to the tech session the tech set section right and there's one for Logitech where you could get 25% off and you just click get now and you'll be provided with a code that you can go into Logitech's website and get 25% off 25% off 100 is 75 which is what I paid for my mouse before taxes. So save a good, you know, $25 off of this mouse instead of paying a hundred for it. So hopefully that is helpful for you guys. Um, I'll try to make a, a update or maybe put a comment down below how I like this mouse from, you know, future usage and everything. And make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up if you thought it was helpful and make sure you share it out and basically subscribe to the channel.